Welcome, we have another new crypto project launching soon and this one today that we are jumping into guys is called Scarab DAO. This is a decentralized venture capitalist DAO launching as an ERC20 on Uniswap guys. As you can see their announcement for this project is that the Scarab DAO launch will be taking place on Monday, October the 2nd at 5 p.m. So if you love brand new projects earlier than anybody else, subscribe to this channel and turn on the bell notifications because we deliver to you guys these projects very fast so that you can be early in cryptocurrency. Now, today we're going to be going over this project uh, and talking all about what is Scarab DAO all about, right? And um, we can see that they have completed their Scarab DAO fair launch. So they did have a fair launch over here. And the good thing about this project is it does in fact have an audit. So I encourage you guys to go ahead and check it out. I will leave links to this project, including the audit and the Telegram group, the social media and their link tree with all of their other links on in the video description, guys, if you would like to go ahead and do your own research after this project is released and uh, this is two of the previous projects from the team and the team is doxed as well guys for this project so that is another good uh, green signal and a good sign but this is AlienFi and this is uh, Astronaut.2 so these two projects uh, previously on the Binance Smart Chain this one and this one over here on Arbitrum were their previous successful projects that they have done here so you can join the Scarab DAO portal which is their telegram group community and this is their link tree with all of their links to their project guys which is the web free decentralized venture capitalist DAO here and I will leave them in the video description so we're going to go over the white paper we're going to uh, go over their Twitter because there's some things uh, on their Twitter as well but this is their main website okay up at the top you will see the link where it says buy scarab so you can go ahead and click that and immediately pick up this token like I said there was a fair launch which has now finished but we will just read the description here so scarab DAO is a decentralized autonomous organization that plays a pivotal role in the ever evolving landscape of blockchain and decentralized governance established as a robust and professional platform for collective decision making and governance, Scarab DAO offers a diverse ecosystem where participants can engage in a variety of activities, including investment proposals, voting on proposals, investing funds, and sharing the profits generated. So there is a doxed team, and there's this um, uh, function called deities and pharaohs. So you can become a deity by holding a certain amount of the token supply here, details of which are right here and also inside of their white paper description. So we We'll get to that we will get to that um soon in this video but uh to become a deity you can uh you get the power to vote on the proposals of what they do with their treasury so as you can see on their website it does say dow investments so they are going to be an investment fund basically and we can the holders of the token can actually choose uh what happens so that is what the function of a dow is if you don't know guys dow stands for decentralized autonomous organization it is an organization in cryptocurrency where all the token holders of a project can have an equal opportunity and a chance to vote on exactly what happens to that project and the decision making process of the investments that that project makes um, in this case where uh, what they do with the you know the funds so collectively vote on investing proposals and grant them to take the funds from the treasury right so you get to choose where your uh, investment power goes basically so if you want to learn more you can click these links and it takes you to the uh, the white papers and so forth uh, you can share profits so there will be shared uh, profits from the generated profits from the investments and grow your portfolio discover the whole new paradigm of governance so it's decentralized autonomous organization which is a professional decentralized system uh, which enables governance and financial empowerment for all of the active users. They will have proposals where they propose investments that can encompass a wide range of actions and activities. Proposals serve as the foundation for shaping the DAO's trajectory. Judgment within the Scarab DAO serves as a means to enforce accountability and adherence to the DAO's rules, guidelines, and ethical standards, which we will learn about soon in the white paper. Um, the Scarab DAO DAP, which is also found at the top of this website as a link, guys, is a gateway to an era of decentralized governance and financial empowerment. With a user-centric focus, it offers a seamless and intuitive interface that allows participants to engage with the DAO's ecosystem effortlessly. And you can click this link to open the DAP once the DAP is uh, fully completed here. It is going to be running on smart contracts integrated inside the DAP, um, which will form the backbone of the DAO's governance model here for Scarab 
DAO, automating the execution of their proposals and the distribution of the rewards, so the financial profits basically. And uh, these smart contracts represent a harmonious fusion of ancient wisdom with the latest technological advancements. Scarab DAO's sleek design and user-friendly interface is going to be aesthetically pleasing and strategically crafted to ensure accessibility with inclusivity. The design principles prioritize clarity and ease of navigation, making it easy for users of varying experience levels to engage with confidence. They also will have the Scarab DAO exclusive NFTs. With a limited quantity of 50 NFTs in total, the Scarab NFTs are highly sought after. The Scarab NFTs are minted exclusively within the Scarab DAO DAP and they will bestow certain privileges to their holders such as proposing investments or judgments taking actions and much more right so you can go ahead and click this link to mint them now I think this is going to be available uh, all, this is all going to be possible of course after Monday the second which is their launch the rewards system is designed to reward active participants uh, so the ticker symbol for this token is B-A-R-A-C-S Barracks token holders are uh, as active participants in the DAO will be sharing the revenues generated by the organization, right? So Scarab DAO's reward mechanism ensures that long-term engagement is rewarded with a greater return upon conversion. So that is what you are going to be rewarded in here. The Scarab token, again, ticker symbol B-A-R-A-C-S, which you can pick it up on Uniswap. Scarab DAO's commitment to transparency and inclusivity is evident throughout its ecosystem. Transparent decision-making processes driven and by majority consensus underscores the dem democratic principle principles at the core of the Scarab DAO and makes it a true community-driven platform where the collective vision prevails, guys. So if we look at some of their recent announcements on Twitter, of course, like I said, the launch is Monday, the 2nd of October at precisely 5 p.m. UTC, guys. Um, so follow them on Twitter and you will see, uh, be able to keep up to date with all of their news and announcements. For example, they do have a super bullish AMA immediately after on Tuesday, October the 3rd at 7 p.m. here and you can click this link to see them live and to see the uh, uh, to connect and become part of their live AMA with uh, Farrakh and Dr. Nort founder. So these are the two team members here. They do I believe have three fully doxxed team members as part of this team as well guys and uh, we can see that they have posted a link to their completed audit as well as announcements about their uh, fair launch which previously happened. Like I said it's going to be an ERC20 token so this is of course guys using the ethereum blockchain they had no airdrops no seed sale it was completely fair organic and public so the marketing has not been activated yet but they do have huge plans for their marketing including uh, a youtube campaign a twitter marketing campaign as well and uh, telegram call community groups as well as amongst many other things right so they do have massive plans for the marketing of their project so like i said at the core of scarab DAO lies the scarab token so s-c-a-r-a-b right so it's native cryptocurrency owning scarab tokens empowers participants to ap actively shape the direction of the DAO. tokens serve as a gateway to meaningful participation in the scarab DAO's ecosystem so we have been through that here. Uh, I will leave you a link to the white paper in the video description. So I encourage you to check it out and go over all of these individual details in your own time and in your own re when you're doing your own research. So always do your own diligence. Nothing in this video is financial advice. Never invest more than you can afford to lose. I am not a financial advisor. So these videos are just for entertainment and education purposes only. So be responsible with your own financial decisions, guys. Um, but yeah, like I said, Scarab is basically a tradable ERC-20 token. It is used for acquiring the Scarab NFTs and can be converted back to into Barax tokens. So there are Scarab tokens plus Barax tokens here. So I believe there are. So there's actually going to be two of their tokens. As a native currency of the DAO, it forms the backbone of the ecosystem. And down here we have the details of the tokenomics of the supply of these two tokens right down here. Okay, and I believe uh, this is the pre-sale listing supply details as well and then they have the links to the scarab token contract address and the scarab uh, links to the ether scan and the scarab price chart here and the uh, link to actively buy it on uniswap so you can see that and the chart 
price action, of course, here once it has launched. So they have NFTs and deities, and this is their main feature, which we mentioned at the start of the video here, guys. And this is how it works. So they have the Scarab NFTs. Within the, the Scarab DAO, NFTs serve as a symbol of prestige and commitment. Scarab NFTs are unique digital assets that are exclusively minted within the Scarab DAP. Their rarity and limited quantity, 50 in total, make them highly sought after and valuable. Minting a Scarab NFT requires one to lock 0.5% of the max supply of the Scarab token inside the locked staking pool. So the Scarab NFTs are not just symbols, but also grant their holders the esteemed title of deity, a role of responsibility and influence within the DAO. The title of deity in the Scarab DAO is a prestigious one, granted exclusively to the holders of Scarab NFTs. Deities uh, play a crucial role in shaping the organization's future and governance. So deities have the unique privilege of proposing investment proposals or judgments within the DAO. These can have significant impacts on the operations and directions of the Scarab DAO. Deities are the custodians of Scarab DAO's governance, representing the community's interests and ensuring that the DAO's decisions align with the collective visions and goals of its members. Proposals and voting. Deities process the privilege and responsibilities of initiating uh, investment proposals that can encompass a wide range of actions and activities. These proposals serve as the foundation for shaping the DAO's trajectory, ensuring that it aligns with the overarching uh, objective and values of the community. Once a proposal is meticulously crafted by a deity, it is submitted to the broader community for voting. This stage marks the commencement of a collaborative process as every community member is encouraged to participate in the evaluation and decision making process. Uh, the voting. So Barax token plays a fundamental role in this process. That is what the Barax token does. So Barax tokens are a representation of active participation, right? So governors influence and revenue sharing within the DAO. Barax tokens are re required for community members to cast their votes on proposed actions, decisions and investments. The outcome of the vote is determined by the principle of majority consensus when a proposal receives substantial uh, support indicated by a majority yes vote it can be executed by the deity so if you're interested you can go up to the scarab tokenomics and see clearly here right so this does have a max supply with an initial market cap in eth 185 eth to be specific and then the barrax token the process of obtaining the barrax token involves the conversion of um, the scarab tokens so the conversion ratio of from the scarab to barrax is one to one in other words for every scarab token exchanged one barrack token is acquired so that is pretty simple here. So here it outlines the functions of the Barracks tokens very specifically and the functions of the Scarab token very specifically. So I do highly encourage you to read these two sections in the white paper over here of the Scarab DAO information. And that is uh, the Scarab and the Barracks section. So the outcome of the vote is determined by the principle of majority consensus. When a proposal receives substantial support indicated by a majority yes vote, it can be executed by the deity. So the core principle of the revenue sharing within Scarab DAO is community driven growth. As the DAO engages in investment activities, generates profits or undertakes revenue generating ventures, these earnings are distributed back to the barracks holders. This distribution is proportional to the active participation and stake held by each barracks holder within the DAO. When the DAO generates profits, these earnings are promptly deposited into the treasury by deities. At this point, barracks token holders have the opportunity to actually claim their rewards in the form of Scarab Arab tokens. So the reward system is inherently tied to the success and growth of the Scarab ecosystem. The more the DAO prospers through sound investments, effective decision making and community involvement, the greater the rewards available to the Barax holders. So this alignment of incentives ensures that all stakeholders have a vested interest in the DAO's flourishing, of course. So and then they have the section here about judgment. Judgment within Scarab DAO serves as a means to enforce accountability and adherence to the DAO's rules, guidelines and ethical standards. It allows the community to address situations where a deity may be in default or has violated the DAO's principles. The judgment proposal process begins with a deity proposing a judgment against another de a deity. This proposal is subjected to the same voted process, voting process as investment proposals within the DAO, ensuring that the broader community has a say in whether the judgment is actually warranted. 
Community members are given the opportunity when it comes to voting to cast their votes on the proposed judgment. So the voting process is conducted using Barak's tokens and the outcome is determined by a majority consensus. This uh, democratic approach ensures that the resolution is not arbitrary but representative of the collective will of the community. The consequences is that if the majority of the community votes in favour of the judgment proposal, the accused deity may face the consequences of their actions or violations these consequences can vary in severity depending on the nature and gravity of the misconduct. Penalties may include the partial or full loss of deities locked scarab tokens reflecting the seriousness of the violation. Note that in the judgment process the accused deity has the opportunity to defend themselves and present their case to the community. So this ensures that the process is not only transparent but also fair to all. And you can see links to their assets down here uh, if you guys want to go ahead and support them perhaps maybe do a little marketing or share some posts and then the links as well so uh, I encourage you to delve deeper into this project it is a pretty interesting concept here the way uh, they have designed it and everything is pretty beautiful and their use of language deities and pharaohs is a very interesting and unique approach especially with minting their NFTs here having the two tokens Barax and Scarab aligning one-to-one -one and being exchangeable one-to-one -one is also a very interesting part of this project so links to the project are down below thank you guys for tuning in once again uh, let me know what you th what you think about this and all the other new and upcoming early projects right here in cryptocurrency my name has been jordan remember turn on the bell notifications on hot cup of crypto because every single day we deliver to you guys brand new cryptocurrency opportunities and we will see you guys soon in the next videos